People say you, you have to have a lot of passion for what you're doing, and it's totally true. And the reason is, uh, is because it's so hard that if you don't, any rational person would give up. It's really hard, and you have to do it over a sustained period of time. So if you don't love it, if you're not having fun doing it, you don't really love it, uh, you're gonna give up. And that's what happens to most people, actually. If you really look at, 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 at the ones that uh, ended up you know, being successful, unquote, in the eyes of society and the ones that didn't, oftentimes it, it's the ones that are successful loved what they did so they could persevere when, you know, when it got really tough. And, and the ones that, that didn't love it quit because they're sane, right? Who would want to put up with this stuff if you don't love it? So it's a lot of hard work and, and it's a lot of worrying constantly. And uh, um, if you don't love it, you're going to fail. So you got to love it, you got to have passion. First of all, when you start out on a career in the arts, you have no idea what you're doing. You have to deal with the problems of failure. You need to be thick-skinned to learn that not every project will survive. A freelance life, a life in the arts, is sometimes like putting messages in bottles on a desert island and hoping that someone will find one of your bottles and open it and read it and put something in a bottle that will wash its way back to you. Appreciation or a commission or money or love. And you have to accept that you may put out hundreds of things for every bottle that winds up coming back. If you have an idea of what you want to make, what you were put here to do, then just go and do that. And that's much harder than it sounds. And sometimes in the end, so much easier than you might imagine. Because normally there are things you have to do before you can get to the place you want to be. But when you have a dream, it doesn't often come at you screaming in your face, this is who you are, this is what you must be for the rest of your life. Sometimes a dream almost whispers. And I've always said to my kids, the hardest thing to listen to, your instincts, your human personal intuition, always whispers, it never shouts. Very hard to hear. So you have to, every day of your lives, be ready to hear what whispers in your ear. It very rarely shouts. And if you can listen to the whisper, and if it tickles your heart, and it's something you think you want to do for the rest of your life, then that is going to be what you do for the rest of your life, and we will benefit from everything you do. Sometimes life is hard. Things go wrong. In life, and in love, and in business, and in friendship, and in health, and in all the other ways that life can go wrong. And when things get tough, this is what you should do. Make good art.